let's talk a little bit about golf. And while I'm discussing golf, I'm going to show you some websites and then I'll show you some slides. Columbia is a golfer's paradise. Columbia is located just north of the equator and therefore has the same temperatures throughout the year. The outside temperatures depend on the altitude above sea level. The capital Bogota, which is located about 8,500 feet above sea level, it's the fourth highest capital in the world, has an average annual temperature of about 57 degrees Fahrenheit, with the range about 43 to 68 degrees. Since Colombia is a golf destination throughout the year, nothing is in the way of a golf trip. In Colombia, there are not four seasons as in the U.S. or in Europe. There is, however, a rainy and a dry season. This varies from region to region. It is not a constant. In Bogota, it can rain at any time whether it's a rainy season or not. There's a variety of golfing in Colombia. Colombia is certainly a unique country in the world and not only offers altitudes from sea level to over 18,000 feet above sea level, but it also has two coasts. The coast of the Pacific is largely uninhabited and left to nature. The Atlantic coast is well populated and contains tourist cities like Cartagena, Barranquilla, and Santa Marta. Golfers therefore benefit from the special conditions in Colombia and get a huge selection of golf destinations across the country with a variety of climatic conditions and different altitudes and topographies. We should immediately proclaim Colombia as the golf capital of the world because the conditions are a taste of paradise. Club Campestre de Armenia is in the heart of Colombian coffee growing area. This region is simply breathtaking and offers many other activities in addition to golf. Although the golf club is located right next to the airport, the aircraft noise is limited. It isn't busy during the day and if an airplane should just start up at an important hole, stay calm. With a spicy coffee grown in the immediate vicinity, the nerves can calm down quickly. The facilities of the Club Campestre de Armenia were founded in March 1937. In February 1954, they purchased an additional 14 blocks of land between Armenia and La Tebaida on the road that leads to the El Aden Airport. The main building, the pool, four tennis courts, and a soccer field were initially built, but in view of the need to expand services, the General Assembly in March 1965 approved the purchase of 25 more blocks that allowed the construction of new tennis courts, the hotel, and nine holes of golf. Subsequently, an assembly held on October 1991, the purchase of yet 40 more blocks of land adjacent to the club was approved for the construction of the remaining nine holes of the golf course and the construction of six tennis courts and a new soccer field. The old field expanded the club parking lots. The club has become a center for group activities, family days, and has an excellent restaurant known for its high quality aged beef and world-class desserts. The question was, if I lived in Armenia, would I have to give up on golf? Absolutely not. In fact, you may find your own personal paradise.